And I want to begin our time together with a, a story that I have told some of you, but I, I love this story because it, it illustrates the point in a very uh, memorable way. And it, it's a story that is actually based on one of Aesop's fables. It was modified by a religious sister who, uh, I, and I, t I tell you that it was modified by a religious sister, you'll know why in a minute. And, uh, and I want to share that with you because I think it proves a fundamental point. And it, it, it begins like this. There's an old man and a young boy. And the old man and the young boy are on a journey together. And they're going along this dirt road. It's a long dirt road. And it's hot. And the, the road is dusty. And it's uncomfortable. And between the two of them, they have one donkey. And this one donkey, they're kind of walking along. And, and the boy says, you know, it's pretty hot. And I'm getting kind of tired. So... What I'd like to do is I'd like to get on the back of the donkey. The old man can lead the donkey. So he gets on the back of the donkey, and the old man's leading it along. And as they're coming along, some people the other directions come up, and they're way off in the distance at first, and then they get closer. And as they're getting closer, you can tell that they're talking, but you don't know what they're saying. And then as you're, as you're t listening, you can hear, actually, they're talking about the boy and the man. In fact, they're complaining about the boy and the man. Well, that's just not right. That's wrong perfectly healthy boy riding on the back of that donkey making that old man walk that's just wrong he should get off the back of the donkey and the boy's just like mortified it's like oh what was i thinking so he gets off the back of the donkey and he's thinking i'm so sorry why don't you ride so they go on a little bit further and the old man is now riding and the boy is walking and some more people come along and they're talking about the couple too they're talking about them and they're complaining also that's just wrong grown man riding the back of the donkey young boy having a walk it's just wrong so the old man gets off a donkey and they said well you know that's that's kind of wrong so they're walking along and no one's riding on the donkey a little while longer some people see him and they say well that's just wrong perfectly healthy donkey nobody riding on it somebody ought to ride on the back of that donkey so they're looking at one another like what are we going to do so they both get on the back of the donkey and so they're going along but they're not going very fast because this donkey's you know crawling along and some people come along, and they're, of course, upset also. What are they doing? Two people on one donkey? They're going to kill the donkey. So they get off the donkey, and they're thinking, what are we going to do? You know, he rode, I rode, nobody rode, both rode, nobody's happy. So they do the only thing they can think about. They pick up the donkey, and they start to carry the donkey. <laughs> so they're kind of going along, they're carrying this donkey. And as they're carrying this donkey, they come across a bridge. And this bridge is over this deep ravine. And it, at the bottom of the ravine is this river. And so they're going along and they're walking across the bridge. And it's hot, it's dusty. And as they get over the bridge, the boy loses his grip. And he starts to lose his grip of the donkey. The donkey starts to tumble out of his hands. Well, the old man, he can't hold the donkey all by himself. So he drops the donkey too. And the donkey falls out of their hands and he, he slips over the side of the bridge. And he rolls into the ravine. And he tumbles into the water and he's in the river and the donkey drowns. And the moral of the story is, if you try to please everyone, you can kiss your ass goodbye. 